Hey, Mets fans, Drew Giacalone here with stand-up comedian extraordinaire Chris Stefano. Patty Fly, boss. How are we doing today, gentlemen? I love that last name, Jackaloni. Yeah, it sounds like like a like a made-up thing. <laughs> yeah, you Jackaloni. We are here at the Caesars <laughs> Sportsbook at the Metropolitan Grill here on the left field side, fifth floor of City Field. We have an amazing spread here. Look at uh, that. I'm ready to uh, do a little taste test here. Yes. Try some of the stuff. But do you know what these are? Uh, I think you're going to tell me. What are they? Chicharron. 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 Yes. Well, let's find out what all these food offerings are and yes. we'll bring in the chef to let us know. Chef? What's going on, guys? Hey, Hello. chef. Would you like a lime? <laughs> <laughs> So here up at Caesar's Sports Grill, we've got our loaded tots there. We've got our version of a Funyun. Bring it back to when we were oh. maybe a little bit of a younger crowd. Here we have our lobster tostada. So fresh lobster salad on top of a tostada, mm. some breakfast radish on there, a little bit of a lobster fondue and a cilantro crema. And then here we have our El Pastor tacos. Nice. So uh, braised down pork. Fresh onion, cotilla cheese, micro cilantro, and that lime, of course, to squeeze over top. And then here we have our version of steak and potatoes. So we make it potato pancake. Got some filet sliced on top there, a little horseradish cream, a little bit of a red wine demi. And then to finish it off, we've got our deconstructed cannolis. Wow. So uh, we take all of those fan favorites with the cannolis, deconstruct them, and, and give it to you guys in a little different way. If you had to guess, how much cholesterol do you think is on this table? Uh, probably a little bit too much. Yeah, yeah. The cannoli is going to finish me off like my life. <laughs> you look like a guy that enjoys a good tickle. Am I right about that? <laughs> look, he's got a good tickle laugh. <laughs> this is fantastic, dude. I realize eating meat like this and potatoes this way, nobody loves me at home. <laughs> nobody cooks for me like this at home. I don't get anything like this. We gotta get uh, Chef over to your house, though. Chef, do you want sleep over? <laughs> I'm gonna try one of these El Pastor tacos here. The seasoning on the El Pastor is fantastic. The, the onions, the crisp onions, everything is just delicious. This is the best thing. Have you had this with the dip? Which, oh, thank you, Chef. What are these called again, Chef? This is the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. Oh, wow. Right? Got the crispy outside, the gooey inside with that cheese. Mm-hmm. Well done. That chef even put fruit on the table. It's like, what do you, dude? No, no one, <laughs> no one's gonna use the fruit. What do we have on the cannoli shells here, chef? So on the cannoli shells, we've got uh, some powdered sugar and a little bit of cinnamon sugar. Beautiful, dude. That cannoli cream is the best. I think it's the best ballpark food I've ever eaten. You guys can't see off camera. Steve Enjoy. Cohen, the owner's son, is holding the boom mic as, as, <laughs> as straight as he can. So that's what the Mets do. They got the owner's son in the background holding up the freaking audio equipment. Because the Mets are trying to save bucks for everywhere they can. Because they showed that a lot of money on the contract. So they got his son doing the boom mic. So, Chris, I hear you have a new special on Netflix. What can you tell us about it? Yes, I do. It's called Speshy Weshy. It's on Netflix right now. And I actually self-produced it. I made it myself. I was gonna just put it out on YouTube. I paid every dollar. I, I, I just said, I'm gonna put this out for the people on YouTube. And then at the last minute, my agent was like, let's send this to Netflix, thinking like there's no way they're gonna buy it because I self-produced it and they don't really operate that way, but we sent it to them anyway. And then boom, they bought it. And, and, it, and so what you're seeing is there's, because a lot of times corporation, you know, on Netflix or an HBO or whatever, they make their edits and their cuts, but my deal was like, hey, I made this the way it is. If you guys want it, then it's got to stay the way it is. And they said, sure. Oh. I was pumping the fact to my fans. I was pumping the fact that I was like, you know, I'm not going corporate, blah, 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 blah. Then Netflix came with that money. I said, forget everything. I just said, we're going to Netflix. <laughs> And Let's then, go, baby! And you know what's crazy is literally the day I announced my Netflix special, the day I announced it publicly is the day that Netflix announced they've had the worst <laughs> quarter in a decade and they're bleeding subscribers like you can't imagine. So if you were one of the few people who's kept, can I actually borrow your Netflix <laughs> subscription? Because I deleted my account and I want to watch my own special. Josh? Everyone gets their own food. That's no, you cool. can't do it, dude. You got a cold sore. Yeah. Get out of here. Stay out of here. Thanks for stopping in with us, guys. It looks like it's about game time. So be sure to come and stop by the Caesar Sportsbook at the Metropolitan Grill. Best food on the planet. Don't miss it. Take care. Enjoy the game.